Okay, I'm gonna start off by saying that I did not want to make a video on this, let alone a rant video, but that's what we're gonna do. But this guy should have come to Global at the same time as JP, my boys! But first, it is time for the subscriber challenge. Now, I want you guys to either pick heads or tails. If you win, then you win, but if you lose, you have to subscribe because that is the challenge. So pick right now, 3, 2, 1, go. What's it gonna be? It's gonna be tails. So if you picked heads, then you lose, and if you lose, you have to subscribe because that is the challenge. This Gohan right here, was the single best thing in this superhero celebration. There was some other good stuff. Piccolo was great. AGL Gogeta was great. But this guy was the best thing of this celebration, in my opinion. For the people that are saying that, oh, you should just be grateful that you even got any of it at the same time. My boys, screw you. Like I said before in a previous video, Dokkan could literally slap these guys, steal their girls, and they'd be like, oh, but you should be grateful for this and you should be grateful for that. Shut up, shut up. How about that? How about that? I'd rather have to wait for the celebration than not wait and get it straight away but not get the best thing. And the best thing is this Gohan. That's just the truth, I'm being honest. This is a global shaft and for anyone saying otherwise, you are just wrong. You are flat out wrong. This is a global shaft. Now don't get me wrong. I am still clinging to the hope that it can still come to global within a week or two. I doubt it, but I think it's still possible. But obviously I'm just being optimistic. It's probably not gonna happen. But realistically, this guy was released on JP and Global at the same time. So it would make sense if they got their easy years at the same time. And them not getting the easy years at the same time is a shaft. It is a big shaft. And anyone saying otherwise is just wrong. I'm sorry to say, this guy should have got the easy year at the same time. And for the people that are saying that this is not part of the superhero celebration, well, you're just wrong. Because what else is it a part of? The argument that they made first is that, no, but this is only a superhero movie celebration. But then, so why are these guys part of this celebration then? And then they say, Oh no, but now it's just a movie celebration. So now they've changed their argument. Now they've completely changed their argument. They are moving the goalpost. This is a logical fallacy, my friends. It is a logical fallacy. The debate ends there. You are wrong. These guys not coming to global is flat out a shaft. And there is nothing that you can say that can change my mind. And the reason I'm saying this guy is the best thing of this celebration is because he's the best easy A in the game right now. Literally, he is the number one easy A. So someone might say, okay, but Piccolo was the best thing. I would say arguably but no because you have to summon for this guy whereas a lot of people already have this guy and not to mention that the Gohan is literally pretty much as good as the Piccolo except for the fact that this guy's been on so many banners that a lot of people will have him so him not getting his easy year at the same time is definitely a shaft and by the way I quickly want to mention that this cell I called it I said that the Gohan will be better because his base kit just had way more potential and I was right. The Gohan is just better. After you transform into Perfect Cell, this guy is really good but in his base form, he's not that good whereas Gohan in his base slash Super Saiyan form is even in this form, he's really good. You can argue he's even better in this form than he is after you transform into Super Saiyan 2 but the point is overall, the Gohan is just straight up better which is what I predicted it would be. Man, it's so annoying that he couldn't get the easy A at the same time, man. This is a complete shaft, and please stop coping. Do the Dokkan devs could steal these people's girls. They could crap on their faces. They could beat the crap out of these guys. They could bully these guys, and these guys would still say, Oh, but at least they did this, but at least they did that, and they would still defend them. Well, guess what? It's time for you to sit down, my friends. It is time for you to sit down. And it is time to riot until we get these guys on global. Who is with me? With that said, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, do subscribe, especially if you failed the challenge because that is the challenge. Also, do leave a like and do leave a comment on the video because those things do help with the algorithm so that more people can see the video. With that aside, thanks for watching and I will see you guys next time.